Breaking right now at noon, new details about the moments leading up to the death of a Boston police officer as his girlfriend answers to several charges in that case. Thanks for joining us here at Noontime. I'm Paula Ebbett. Officer John O'Keefe was found unresponsive in the snow on Saturday and later pronounced dead at the hospital. We want to get right to WBZ's Beth Germano, who's live in Stoughton with uh, what role prosecutors say Karen Reed played in his death. Beth? Well, certainly a very tragic story, and those details were revealed in a courtroom that was packed with two different families. Bail was set at $50,000 for Karen Reed, but she posted bail and just left the courthouse with her attorney and family members. Prosecutors say she had been in a relationship with Boston police officer John O'Keefe for two years. She's facing manslaughter, motor vehicle homicide by negligent operation, leaving the scene of an accident. After Officer O'Keefe was found Saturday morning in the middle of the blizzard with severe cuts to his arm, Arms, eyes swollen shut, cuts to his head, and a skull fracture. Prosecutors say Reed and O'Keefe had been to two bars Friday night, then went to an after party in Canton where she dropped him off but didn't stay. She allegedly told police she made a three point turn, never saw him go in the house, and went home. But when O'Keefe didn't return, prosecutors say she became frantic, contacting friends to go back to the house. Throughout the night, she'd been calling and texting uh, the victim numerous times uh, with no response. <coughs> Officers also interviewed uh, several first responders, including a uh, firefighter paramedic from the town of Canton, uh, indicated that uh, she arrived on scene, observed the victim's condition, uh, went to uh, speak to the defendant in regard to any uh, sort of prior medical issues or, or causality of the, uh, the injuries uh, that she observed to his face, uh, to which the defendant uh, then made several statements uh, to her, indicating, I hit him, I hit him, I hit him, I hit him. Now, prosecutors say there was a rear taillight damaged and other damage to her vehicle and that the victim was found in the location where he was dropped off. Reed and her friends say prosecutors discovered his body. Reed even tried to lend CPR, but he was transported to the hospital and later died. Now, the defense says the charge of manslaughter is a reach in this case and that Reed is not a flight risk and that she was in a loving relationship with John O'Keefe. Reporting live from outside Stoughton District Court, I'm Beth Germano, WBZ News.